Hello, it's Luna Light. I hope you're having an absolutely wonderful day. Today's video you picked on my Instagram polls. If you would like to participate in said polls, follow the link below to my Instagram. Today's video is looking at what I have in my everyday bag. And this is it. Now I like to carry a little backpack. This is the um, Killstar. I don't know how to pronounce this. I think it's Kaiko. Kiko. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, okay? Kiko Kaiko Kitty backpack. The straps on the back are adjustable, but they do have a really annoying habit of like sliding down every time I tighten them up, so that's, that's fun. Now there is a zip missing. There were two when I first had it. One of them fell off. Killstar, you know, sometimes their quality is a little questionable. And it's a shame because this stuff is really nice. Killstar, please, please just work on the quality. So this is a really cute backpack all the same. I really love this. Kitty ears little kitty face and it's got killstar written right here this is handy for you like i don't want to hang it up so there's a couple of compartments on the outside and then there's some on the inner so we're gonna start with this one which is just like a normal slip thing and there's nothing in there so that's that's fun this one is a side pocket and usually i keep my car keys in this but today i have two euros that is very exciting i can't even remember where those euros came from. This little front part where the kitty has a zip and in here, I'm gonna grab everything out. What the heck is that? I found a little piece of paper with 24 written on it and Royal Mail on the back. So that's come from the post office, but no idea where or how. Got some Happy Lips lip balm, which smells like strawberries. Oh. So good. I always, always need some lip balm on me because I have really dry chap lips all the time and it's extremely annoying. My keys. And I've had some of these many, many years. My car keys are actually not in my bag. I think I've left them in my coat pocket. Uh, but we have my regular set of keys. There's a little Harry Potter group indoor crescent. Something with my name, which I've had. God, I've had this since I was like a teenager. It's got a little M on there. Um, what's this? Someone special keyring that I don't remember. <laughs> I'm sorry if you gave this to me, I don't remember. It's one of those tatty teddy ones. You'll see I've had these so long. This one I got from France when I went on an exchange trip. It's a little owl, how cute. And then this is one of those, I don't even know if it works. No, it doesn't work. It's one of those little torch. Oh, okay, it works. It's so one of those little like light torches you use to you light the key hole and see in the dark when you're trying to put your keys in. Let's delve into the main part now. Oh, is it going to get interesting? Probably not. We have two pockets right here. The only thing I have... Oh, okay, what's this? That's a little piece of paper with my doctor's appointment written on it, which I've already had. I was back in August. My key for the other set of doors, my house. Actually, that keyring, this keyring has a little bit of an interesting story. This came from an old Toki Doki bag that I used to own, and I kept it because it's heart and like bones, and I thought it was cute. So, yay. And a little bottle of hand sanitizer because you never know when you will need this, especially at the moment. That normally stays in here, it must have fallen out. I have more pieces of paper. This is the shopping list that I went to Tesco's with today. That is so exciting. Look, we have spinach, we have milk, bread, tomatoes, cucumber, all salady bits. Very, very exciting. Oh, okay, fair enough. My car keys are actually in here after all. They're just in the main pocket. Um, I was lazy and I chucked them in there. So that's my car keys. That little card thingy there is my REC insurance breakdown cover whatnot a mask which is just a little gingham one got little elastic bits on the side and a little filter stretchy elastic ear thingies what are they called i don't know Duh. wonderful and that's for the situation right now oh goody tesco receipt which i'm not going to show because it has car details on it that was the receipt from the list that i bought the list that i bought that was the receipt from the shopping list i showed you fun exciting time isn't it oh a little little pocket mirror now okay hang on we're, we're straying and then my enchantra i think they're called sunglasses from killstar i love these they're so cute i always always keep a pair of sunglasses in my bag because i get headaches if it's like 
sunlighty outside. And then my purse, which is the Luna Wallet from Killstar. I think it's the Luna Wallet. I'm sorry, probably don't know the name, but I've had it forever. I really probably should get a new one because it is looking a bit beaten up but you know it functions and when things function I have a hard time throwing away because I'm like why why would I throw it away if it still works you know oh as the receipt wonderful I have so many receipts in here it's ridiculous okay a bunch of cards this is my card for the the fashion museum and now it's on the floor fashion museum from Bath which I went to a couple of years ago with my friends and this is a pass, an annual pass, uh, which has now expired I believe. Yeah, just expired. This would allow you to go into the um, the museum and the art gallery. Uh, it's either for, for a lot cheaper, I believe, you get a discount. We have a whole bunch of crap in here. Uh, it's mostly receipts to be honest with you, but then we've also got my, my Holland and Barrett card should be in here. Yeah, there it is. Now I, I don't use this too often, but it's my points card for Holland and Barrett. I have all my cards along here, so we have... Oh, my goodness. Body Shop card. An old Asda gift card from Christmas. A receipt from Marks and Spencer's that's come out of nowhere. Cafe Nero stamp thingy. When you fill all the stamps, you get a free coffee. Woohoo. That gift card should really be thrown away because... It's got nothing on it. I've got my beauty club card from Debenham Superdrug. Boots, points card. Tesco club card, yes. I am forever in Tesco. It's like, I go there nearly every day. It's ridiculous. Like, we run out of food all the time in this house. Uh, driving license. Can't show you that because, okay, I can show you the picture. <laughs> look at that face. Look at that face. Hi guys. Oh look, my travel money card that I took on holiday last year. I'll probably use this again if we go on holiday again. I can't show you because it's got number on it, but the post office, the money cards that you top up, and then you can spend it abroad without getting like crazy fees. Payment cards, which I don't fancy getting robbed. So I am going to leave those inside my purse. Actually this, considering even though the moon is like really scratched up and everything, it's like I say, it's still going strong and I'm very proud of it. So that is it. I'm sorry. It's it's very, very boring. I know I don't carry a lot on me and that is because I have chronic back pain and I don't like to carry like a ton of crap because it gets heavy and it hurts my back. So I just carry like the basic essentials. I will also put in whatever like makeup that I'm wearing. So it's usually an eyeliner and lip color, sometimes a concealer and that will go in the back pocket here. And I usually only take that if I'm going out, you know, for more than a few hours because otherwise there's no point in just carrying it for the sake of it. But you may be wondering why there are no feminine products in here because most ladies who have a period will carry those, um, but I don't. The short version is I use period pants, so I don't carry um, general like pads and tampons for the most part. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments what video you'd like to see next. Keep an eye on my Instagram because there are polls happening on there. You get to decide what videos that I make, so make sure you go and look and have your say. I'm sorry if my outfit looks weird. By the way, I had a pink top uh, it's the pink, it's the same top as this one, but in pink, and I had that on today. But I had to change because I had lunch and I spilled soy sauce all over it, so there's a fun fact. Anyways, thank you, bye!